What's up guys, it's Mike here from Mike's Cards and Stickers and today we're going to be opening up three more packs of the Harry Potter Metal Mini Card Collection from Panini. So if you haven't already seen these uh, elsewhere on YouTube, in the shops or on my videos, these are mini dog tags, essentially. Really nice quality, really, really cool, and something different as well. These were £2.49 a pack from Smith's Toys, but they were on sale. I think they were three quid uh, normally. Uh, but you get two metal mini cards inside, and there are 40 to collect. So let's get these straight open. We'll open up the three packs to get the six out, and then if there's any, which there should hopefully be, uh, we shall put them in the binder at the end. So if you want to see that, stay tuned. And each packet as well includes a checklist showing all the ones that you can get. 1 to 20 just there. Famous characters and objects and houses and charms and stuff. And then 21 to 40 there. And you get one of those inside of every pack. So our first metal mini card is number 34, Student Houses. And that is... Hufflepuff. There we go. Now that is a duplicate. I know I've already got that because I pulled that in the previous video. Uh, so yes, but that is what these little tags look like. You can see how thick they are. Nicely made. There's a slight burr on the back, which is a little bit disappointing that it won't rounded off, but the front is rounded off nicely. So that is our first one. And our second one for this pack is number 33. Now I do know that I need this one, and that is... Gryffindor, you can see the line just there, and they've got this blue film on as well to protect them, which is a really good idea. And there you go, nice golden colour. Very nice. So that is one that I need. Now, I'll move that pack out of the way, on to the next one. So expensive, these are guys, so expensive. So if you can like, comment, and subscribe, it really does help to support the videos. And the next one is number 18, which is Horcrux, and it is at the tiara again. Now, I've already got that, and I've already got one duplicate, so I've now got three of them. <laughs> so there we go. That is the Horcrux, the tiara. Turn it into the light. There we go. And the final one for that little pack is number 20, which is also Horcruxes, and that is the diary, Tom Riddle's diary. With a nice big stab mark down the front of it. <laughs> Very nice indeed. So I do need that one, that's good. <laughs> okay, and on to the final packet. Another checklist. And our first one is... Oh, it's number 34 again, you're kidding me. Another awful puff. Damn. <laughs> so another Hufflepuff, you've already seen that one. So I've now got two duplicates of them. Put that over to the side. And come on, let's make this another one that I actually need. Oh, number 40. Excellent. I do believe that I need that one. And that is Bookbeak. I think I need that one. We're about to find out. <laughs> that looks really good, that one does. It's like the artistic form. As opposed to like the CGI image of it. Right, so that we only looks like we only need three there from those. So let's bring in the binder. All to the camera. And here it is, and it opens up like that, and it's like a little frame. So we start with number 20, which is just down here, and they just simply press in. And then they've got a little finger tap if you want to get them out again. Because the starter pack does include a little rubber frame and a keychain if you want to actually have these as a proper dog tag. And the next one is number 33, which is just here. And presses in like so. And then finally, it is number 40, which goes off over here, just there, right in the bottom corner. So we got three from those six just then. Now, all the duplicates will be available on Mike's Cards and Stickers eBay shop. So if you need any of them, or if you need any other cards for that matter, head on over there. It really does help to support the channel. So that, guys, was another three packets of the Harry Potter Mini Metal Cards. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do give it a big thumbs up. So I know. Drop a comment down below as well. Uh, and, of course, make sure to subscribe. It really does help to support the channel. 
And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time.